Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Toho Puppet Play. I am your host, Melee Wizard, and before we get started, there's one thing I need to make mention of. Uh, I... I had kinda sorta knew about this, but it didn't really put all the pieces together until after that last video. If... The... The designer, uh, Achia Sane, he or she or whoever, uh... They, for the, all the evolved forms, you put in a uh, put in a bunch of uh, placeholder moves to be learned at level one. The thing is, all of those moves are either really powerful, not on their normal move list, or both. Case in point, that Kogasa that I faced last time. She does learn uh, Shadow Force, but she's not supposed to know that until level 56, as opposed to the level 36 that we fought then. And also, Mystic Water is not something she's supposed to know at all. Uh, frankly, the the Layla I fought back at the Bonica Tower was the same way. And while knowing this, it's definitely going to make things a bit more difficult in the immediate future, considering that move, these things are these evolve forms are going to know moves they really shouldn't be knowing at this point, or if at all. So, if everything will even themselves out when their normal move pools take uh, takes hold again, but thing is, they're not gonna be. It's not gonna fully fix itself until we hit maybe the mid 50s or something. Uh, uh, yeah, sure, ice punch, why not? Whew, good. <laughs> Well, hey, it worked once. At least I'm not giving Kawakuma a chance to use Shockwave, because that would suck. Uh, let's see. You know what? Yeah, Cerno, why not? Taking advantage of the fact that I don't think the, they have very good uh, physical defense. So yeah, keeping Ice Punch is has been a good idea. Not that I was really considering getting rid of it that much, but... Uh, okay, so I already fought you. Is there anything in here? Yes, there is. TM1 Focus Punch. Blah. Alright. Ooh, a protein. Uh, what does that do again? Uh, attack. I'm really the only one that does... It's either Yomu or Yamame. Which one has the better attack stat? 161. Okay, yeah, Yamame's getting that one. Alright. Oh! You're not a... I'm not gonna fight you. Okay. Kind of odd, but I'll take whatever blessings I can get. Uh, let's see. Aha! 41 Will O Wisp. Alright. Really? It's not like I was really trying to hide. Yep. <laughs> Alright, are you going to send out another Hina? You're sending out a Kogasa. A Chibi Kogasa. I'll let you stay out for that. Something I should have used against the last Kogasa, but... 
Oh well. Uh, Rumia. Uh, what's Rumia weak against again? La da 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 da. Steel faith. I hit the wrong button. There we go. That wasn't so bad. Rumia having levitate didn't do me any favors, but. Ah! Here's somebody! Yeah, yeah, whatever. Ooh, so close. Uh, Parsi. Heart and Dark, I believe. Uh. Sane! Uh, yeah, Sane. <laughs> Times four! <laughs> Alright, where to from here? Aha! Sponica Singular? Sponica Singular! Should be Iron. Ooh boy. I'm a little surprised the Ice Punch did that much damage. Wow! I'm I'm impressed, sir. No. <laughs> wow. Uh, on that note, I think I need to switch Yamame up front. Uh, Sirno's not taking as much of a beating. All right, what do we got here? A full heal. All right. Max revive. Oh wow. And an escape rope. Yes, you are! And you found a pretty good spot to do it in, too. I uh, don't think there's too much left to do in here. I think only two floors worth of guys. Okay, there's nobody here. And the... Uh, the teleporter to the end is on this floor, so... That's pretty much why I started at the top. Again with the Kogasa, why? Uh, wait, Yamame has shadow hit. Yamame, your defense is so lovely. Hey. Let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna go Nittery. Just go pure beef on this one. There we go. Yeah, I have a tendency to try to level up my party in whatever RPG I'm playing as evenly as possible. Whether how well that works depends, but uh, is there someone over here? No. Okay. Is it this teleporter that takes me to? Yes. Yes, but I'm not doing that yet. If nothing else, I definitely want to heal before doing that. Ooh, hyper potion. Ah. 
Obviously. And we're gonna see how well that works for you. It's nice that my team has such has such a wide range of moves. It gives me multiple options. <laughs> Better to have too many options than not enough, frankly. All right. So, second floor. What do you got? Oh, okay. Ah, uh, going around, beating up bad guys, taking their money. Standard hero procedure, right? Okay, Yamame just took a bubble beam to the face and only did like 19 damage. Super effective. Wow, that that is that is just wow. Uh, yeah, Nittery. First Gogasa, that was a kind of a hair's breadth kind of one thing, but okay. Says you. You had one turn that I was worried about, and you used it on Rain Dance? Okay, <laughs> why? Ah, whatever. I see that there's a guy here. And, uh, you know what, I'm gonna switch Nittery up front. Considering Iron's part poison, I was worried there, but Psybeam, fine. Ooh, Discharge. How good is Discharge? Very good. I'm never using that, so bye-bye. Another Iron. Yeah, why not? Whew. 
<laughs> and Irons give a good bit of experience. Dang it, she almost knocked herself out from confusion. It was so close. Alright. Ah, we got somebody in there. Oh. Okay. So, so I, I actually had to talk to you, even though you're facing me. Okay. Probably should have used Aqua Jet, considering, but I... My finger slipped. Go ahead and stun spore me. That just means that you can't poison me with poison jab. Great bit of strategy there. Iron, why would you use recover when you're at full health? That makes no sense. Uh, yeah. Yes! <laughs> I, I love it so much when I see that. Not so much if it happens to me. I knew you were rocket because you attacked me, duh! Thunder Wave! Mm, it is convenient, but no thank you. And I'm gonna go heal up and get ready for that rival fight. Alright, so it was this one, right? Yes. Now, from past history, you're gonna start off with a medicine. Which means, Cerno, on deck! Let's do this. I'm still wondering how the rival gets into Silph Co. Granted, probably it's the same reason we got into Silph Co, but. Cyrano, Blaster. Oh, wow. No one shotting here! Eek. Oh, dang. Oh, dang. Hey, uh, Quakuma, finish her off. Hopefully. Okay, <laughs> well, a critical hit. There we go. And your first one being level 40. That worries me. Goliath. Oh shoot. Yomu, go. I know you had a Shanghai, but I didn't think you would keep it long enough to become a Goliath. Uh, come on. Oh jeez. Okay, it didn't paralyze, thank goodness. Come on, finish her off, finish her off. Yes, okay. Next, uh, Patchouli. Keep you out. 41. Thing is, I have no idea what Patchouli's gonna have. She has such a wide range of attacks, and it doesn't matter. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh. Jimmy Marissa? Um. Okay! A new one! <laughs> Jimmy Marissa! 
at level 38. Oh, jeez. Please, Yama may one shot her, please. Because I'm, I'm afraid of what Marissa's gonna have. Okay, so Swift isn't the be all end all for accuracy that it has been in the past. Okay, I'm cool with that. And. Alice. Evolved Alice. Still straight reason. Which means. Yamame? No. Uh. Yomu, you're in. Alice of 44, wow. Come on, come on. Critical hit, yes! <laughs> That's probably the only reason why I... Of course. Didn't even see how much damage that did. I was too busy celebrating and gloating. Shadow Ball, huh? I had thought about this, because I, I knew she was going to be learning that at some point. And uh, while it is a higher attack power, the fact that Yomu's attack is so much better than her special attack, plus Shadow Hit's high crit rate, I'm actually inclined to keep Shadow Hit. Well, actually, I'm probably never going to use Fury Cutter again. I'll get rid of that. I probably will get rid of Shadow Ball eventually, but it's a nice move. To it's an improvement over what I've got already. No sense in getting rid of a bad move just because of personal preference. Oi! Sir, no, I'm sorry! <laughs> uh, meanwhile... Yes, I did. And a Rinosuke. Rinosuke is a dream type, so I'm thinking it, he will, he can learn strength. I'll check on that later, and I'll show the stats off when I check him, uh, check him out in the box. In the meantime, I got some more healing to do. Actually, I'll you take the elevator. All right, I'm wondering whether or not I should keep. Cyrano in the lead. I know I've got, I know I had though this one more guy here. So let's see what you got. The Rumia. Yeah, Sine, why not? Sine, you can do better than that. I know you can. Or maybe not. Yeah, I'm wondering. I'm actually. Curious as to see who's got the better attack power, Sane or Yamame. And I'm gonna check and see. 59. Sane's special is actually better. And decision is special, so. Eh. Hmm. Though she will. She does learn a pretty good faith type move pretty soon, hopefully. I should have put Nittery up front. I should have put Nittery up front. Oh dear. Because I knew you had it. Evolve Suica. Oh dear. Eh. Uh, okay. Ooh, you're frozen. I will take advantage of this. I'm 
I'm gonna switch over to Nittery now, and hopefully that will do the job. Come on. Don't thaw out just yet. Good. Good, 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 good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stupid sandstorm. Okay, one more hit, and that should do it. And so we can still froze it. Very nice. Very nice. Now, having Nittery as kind of my counter against Earth types is kind of a double edged sword, considering she's part wind. But her special attack is so good that unless. I'm fighting with someone like Suika, who apparently her either her hit points or her defense is beefed out. Uh attack mode Kane. She's she's not reason no more. She that's part beast, isn't she, isn't it? Which means I should keep Nidori out. I know she's got a different type, but I forget what it is now. Besides beast. Beast Steel? I don't know. Beast Earth, I guess. Oh, but hopefully being attack mode means her defense isn't that good. Let's see. Yes, good. Oh, wow. Uh, Yugi. Nittery, this is what I brought you for. Although, the rock moves are going to be that much more troublesome now. But... Okay, that's good. Imprison? Why would anyone have Imprison? That, that move makes no sense to me. For those who don't know, uh, Imprison, at least in this game, is a Faith-type move that basically prevents move prevents moves that are known by both you and the person you're fighting against. So it's like, why? Eh, makes no sense. Alright. Vermilia. That's right. Evolve Vermilia, which means dark flying. Yomu! Perfect! Steel will be quad quad strong against Romelia. Perfect. <laughs> Even at a level 45. Eek. Oh, Yomu Steel type. That's probably why she didn't get hit by the sandstorm. Uh yep, blade slash. Blade flash, which. Oh wow, it's not even that strong of a move and it did that much. Technically that's the weakest move Yomu's got now. Dang. <laughs> that just shows how strong Yomu is or how weak Romelia's defense is, maybe. But okay! Two th over 2,000 experience. Wow. Well, that went well. <laughs> uh. Yeah, yeah, off you go. Yes, you can. And we get the one lunatic orb to be had. Yeah, it's a shame we can't buy more. I think I already know who I plan on using that on. Still a long ways off, but it's a thought. All right. So now that I've done that, I am going to go ahead and show off Renosuke, and I think I'm going to end it off there, since I know there's at least two fights that I've shown in their entirety for reasons other than me one-shotting everything. Uh, actually... There was one other thing I want to do real quick. Now that I can. 
I'm sure you saw the... Oh, that's an... Ah, I wouldn't have recognized that Alice in sprite form, I guess. You might have seen the uh, the doll that I had in my uh, in the, my inventory. Oh, it's a, you're a move tutor. Oh, I thought I thought she gave you a TM. And I believe that's a Romelia, and that's a uh, Mistia. Um. Who was in here? I think uh, there was a rocket blocking this place, too. Tokiko? Let's see, was there anyone else that... I think that might have been it, aside from the gym. I'm, def I'm gonna hold off on that for now. I might... I'm gonna scout it, just to see... If that place is that any stronger than the Fuchsia City Gym. Actually, on that note, I've been meaning to look at my stats, because I know it shows... Okay, it doesn't show the, the trainer's face, the gym leader's face. Oh well. Anyway. Time to show off Renosuke, one of the few male characters in the Toho universe. And you are Steel Dream, number unknown. I want to say it's like 153 or something. Collector. And his moves aren't really much to speak of. I'll find out off screen if he can learn strength. It sucks that I have to switch a person out for Victory Road, but it is what it is. So until next time, this is Melee Wizard, and have a nice day.